Good morning, everybody. I'm so happy to be here on this Thursday. Let's sing our good morning song. Are you ready? Way up in the sky, the little birds fly. Way down in the nest, the little birds rest. With the wing on the left and the wing on the right, they snuggle down deep all through the night. Shh. Then the bright sun comes up and the dew falls away. Good morning, good morning, the little birds say. Good morning, everybody. Let's sing This Land is Your Land. Do you remember that one? I think we've sung it before on the videos, but I'm not sure. So let's sing that one this morning. Ready? This land is your land. This land is my land. From California to the New York Islands, from the redwood forests to the Gulf Stream waters, this land was made for you and me. Do you remember that song? That's a fun song. There are lots of verses to that song that we will learn later. All right, let's read our book today. It is called Water land and water and land forms around the world by Christy Hale. Do you remember the work that we have in our classroom that has the little brown boxes? They're about that big and you pour the water in and you can see where the water goes and it goes around the land forms. Do you remember that work? Well, this is what that book is about. Water, land. Let's see what it has to say. Lake. A lake is water surrounded by land on all sides. Watch what happens when I turn the page. Island. An island is land surrounded by water on all sides. I would like to go to this island. Bay. A bay is some land that has water on that. Oops. A bay is some water that has land on three sides. One, two, three. Watch what happens. This is a cape. A cape is land that has water on three sides. One, two, three. This is a straight. A strait is a body of water with land on two sides. Let's see. Here's one and here's one. Watch what happens. <gasps> this is an isthmus. An isthmus is land with water on two sides. One, two. This is a system of lakes. Do you remember the lake at the very beginning? A system of lakes is when there's more than one lake very close to each other. This is an archipelago. An archipelago is an islands that are also close to each other. This is a gulf. A gulf also has is water with land on three sides. One, two, three, but it's very big. This is a peninsula. It is land with water on three sides. One, two, three but it is also very big. And 
here are water and land forms that we can see. The lake and the island, a bay and a cape, a strait and an isthmus, a chain of lakes and an archipelago, a gulf and a peninsula. Yeah, it's a really good book about landforms. I'm going to put this in the classroom for when we come back to school, if we come back to school soon. All right. I hope that you have a great day and I will talk to you later. Bye.